Well, a little bit of a break from the heat today with a few more scattered showers and storms across Acadiana. Now, typical July weather as we head into Friday and then perhaps a little bit drier as we head into the weekend. More on that in just a little bit. But first, taking a look at our bigger picture. And it's always informative to look at the mid and upper parts of the atmosphere as it kind of sets the stage to what's going on uh, here at the surface. Now the upper high that's kind of dominated our forecast the last several days starting to break down and lift out of here. Uh, so that helped to give us a break from the heat today, but it also allows these little weaker disturbances to kind of move in from the east. This is what we call an inverted trough. It's actually been parked over uh, southeastern Louisiana over the last several days, really giving them a good bit of rainfall. So places like Morgan City, Thibodeau, my hometown, you kind of know what I'm talking about. And as that kind of slid westward this afternoon, that helped to give us those scattered showers and storms over the course of the day today. But the good news is all of that has since dissipated and we're looking to stay relatively quiet overnight tonight and into tomorrow morning. And even better news than that, tomorrow is Friday, so TGIF all day long tomorrow. Things looking pretty good tomorrow morning. Lows again a little bit cooler in the lower to mid 70s. Maybe an isolated storm or two through the course of the morning and that kind of continues tomorrow afternoon. So I think the overall coverage is going to be much lower than what we saw today. Instead, very typical July afternoon out there. High temperatures in the lower 90s and about a 20 to 30 percent chance for isolated activity into the afternoon. All that should dissipate tomorrow evening and then heading into Saturday, a little bit more drier air moving in. So we'll hold rain chances at around 10 to 20 percent as again, our high temperatures back in the lower 90s heat indices sitting at around 100 degrees or so. Now again, drier air moving in for Saturday kind of continues into Sunday. More moisture probably for eastern Acadiana and into portions of south East Louisiana heading into Sunday. So those will be the best chances to see rainfall. Our rain chances staying again relatively low into Sunday and then very typical summertime pattern for the majority of next week. High temperatures in the lower to mid 90s each and every afternoon with about a 30 to 40 percent chance for scattered activity in our afternoons. And then later next week we may see another easterly wave kind of move into the area that could enhance our rain chances as we head later into next week and then perhaps a little bit drier into next weekend. Now expanding it out here into the open Atlantic, several tropical waves kind of extending all the way to the African coastline. Now none of these are any areas of interest or nothing that the National Hurricane Center is monitoring. But again, this is kind of eating away at that dust in the uh, open Atlantic. So, you know, a little bit more favorable as we head into the, the months ahead into the peak of the hurricane season, which is September 10th. So some of these waves could turn into tropical uh, depressions and storms as we head later into the hurricane season. Nothing out of the ordinary, but just something to kind of keep in mind as we head into the peak months of the season. We can lows tonight, lower to mid 70s. All that storms, all those storms about all but gone. 30 percent chance for scattered activity in our afternoon tomorrow. High temperatures topping out in the lower 90s. Rain chances coming down again through the weekend with those high temperatures in the lower 90s and then a very typical summertime pattern as we head into next week. 30 to 40 percent rain chances, maybe a little bit higher as we head later into next week. But again, those high temperatures sitting in the lower to mid 90s each and every afternoon. Now that'll do it for weather. We have much more coming up right after the break.